Now let's check the final output of our application. Notice when I mouse over, here I'm getting the rows and columns are changing the colors. Notice wherever the my cursor pointing, the rows and columns are changing. Let's write the code how to implement the background colors, rows and columns, the crosshair implementation in a table. So let's start the coding part. For that, just for the time serving, I have created one small table which contains the table headers, rows and columns. That's it. And now in the body, uh, above the body, after the header section, I'm adding style. First, I'm adding some style here. Table border collapse border let's have the border collapse which is a collapse width 100 percent now the next i'm adding for the ph and tds border border one pixel solid and a black color i'm adding padding 8 pixels, 8 pixels, text align center, table header, background color, the background color I'm adding maroon, table color I'm adding, and after that, after that I'm adding T body, TR, table row, nth child, nth child even even background color which is white background color white i'm adding the body if the colors are not looking good will change also so just for the random i'm adding here colors change odd odd background color is white after that I need to add when I mouse over, I want to highlight the rows and columns of the background color. So for that, I'm creating one, uh, one class name here, class which I will add in the JavaScript, this class name. Background color, background color I'm adding, let's add uh, orange red, here the maroon color, no, let's add the blue green color and color of the text is white color and cursor pointer that's how the cursor pointer that's it we have done the styles up to now now we require the now let's write the script script here now inside the script i'm defining one constant variable columns constant cells document dot query selector all the query is a TDs and TH, comma TH table, data and table headers. I'm adding after that for loop for let's sell of cells. Let's sell of cells. Cell dot add event listener. I'm defining one event listener called mouse over mouse over function. The event name is a mouse over. Then I'm defining one function uh, inside this function let's close this one i'm adding one constant column cells column cells is equals to document dot query selector all now here i'm adding back tick mark query selector now here um td TD column and the child and the child dollar dollar cell dot cell index cell index let's add the in icon I tap it. index plus one plus one plus one again comma now I require the nth child for th this one for td and this one for th and after that 
constant row cells row cells is equals to cell dot cell dot parent element dot query selector all td comma th td comma th let's close this one again for let c of column cells c of column cells c dot class list class list dot add here the class list the even when i mouse over i want to apply these styles of this highlight let's copy this one and paste here again for let r of r of row row cells r of row cells row cells r dot class list dot add here i am adding here i am adding highlight highlight let's close this one and after that now instead of writing the same thing cell add event listeners let's copy this one and paste here and this one and this one instead of mouse over i am adding mouse out this is a second event for the mouse out this is the mouse over and this is a mouse out everything this coding is same except i'm changing the mouse out instead of mouse over and mouse out and also here the most important step is we need to remove remove the styles of the highlight that's it we have done the complete coding part now let's save this file we'll check the final output of our application for that we need to open the file explorer the folder i have created in the e drive and the folder name is a javascript interview and this is the file name crosshair rows columns color crosshair rows columns color let's open that one and here we got the final output of our application notice when i mouse over oops something went wrong we'll check the styles of our the script i think this script it's it we need to add below the table sometimes if the script does not work put the code the script code below the body tab that's it now i hope it works now save the file we'll check the final output of our application i'm reloading the browser now let's check the final output of our application notice when i mouse over here i'm getting the rows and columns of changing the colors notice wherever the my cursor pointing the rows and columns are changing even the header also i have added the colors to the header also that's it in this video tutorial i have explained how to implement the crosshair background colors for rows and columns simultaneously in a table in a html table using a javascript and css tags thanks for watching this video tutorial please subscribe share and leave your valuable comment we'll catch you in my next video tutorial